Um, anyway, still sticking with the England women's team. Uh, like you saw there, they're wearing blue shirts uh, instead of white. That's because they've agreed uh, to swap their white shirts for blue. Uh, the FA announced this uh, earlier in the week after players voiced their concerns about playing in white whilst on their period. Uh, the FA did not provide this reason in the switch uh, in its media release. Uh, but England forward Beth Mead had said last year that the team spoke to official kit manufacturer Nike about a potential change uh, because white shirts were not practical uh, when it's that time of the month uh, for the women. Uh, European champions England uh, will now continue to wear blue shirts as they routinely do in training uh, for both their home and away kits for this month's friendlies like they did against Brazil uh, and their next one against Australia and also at the Women's World Cup uh, in Australia New Zealand uh, from the 20th of July to the 20th of August. Uh, already uh, in the Women's Super League in England, women's teams at Manchester City and West Bromwich Albion have switched to Navy and Burgundy shorts, respectively, uh, while the Ireland women's rugby team also announced a change to Navy blue shorts last month from green. Uh, the New Zealand women's soccer team will also swap their home case white shorts for teal blue to ease uh, this period uh, anxieties. Uh, that's according to the uh, country's football association this week. Uh, New Zealand will wear the kit in friendlies against Iceland today and against Nigeria when they play us next week and at the Women's World Cup, which they will co-host with Australia uh, from the 20th of July to the 20th of August. Uh, the issue of women athletes wearing white clothing was also brought up last year uh, at Wimbledon uh, during the tennis Grand Slam when female players spoke about the anxiety of being forced to wear white on their period. Uh, the grass court Grand Slam will make an exception to restrict all white dress code to allow female players to wear dark colored undershorts from this year's tournament. So of course, uh, the sport having to adapt to the needs uh, of its athletes, uh, because of course, I mean, the women don't control these things uh, and they don't have to be put in a position where they don't have control about you know how they look and how they feel. And of course, their anxieties have to be taken into proper consideration.